Hi guys, welcome back to another daily tarot card. These are your daily tarot cards for Wednesday, March the 22nd, 2023. Today we're pulling from the Nightmare Before Christmas tarot cards. So we're starting off with the world card. And if you can see there, there's many doors, many opportunities here. I feel like this is the Enchanted Forest. I think it's, I can't remember if it's the Seven of Boons, but they have these trees and they all have doors on them. And they're saying we're, I feel like we're at a crossroads right now where like literally before I started filming, like I filmed for all platforms and it was Instagram. It was like 999. So I'm like, I know I'm in the precipice of change. I, I, I feel like everything is being very aggressive. If you look at the shorts you or if you follow, uh, well, it'd be shorts in this case for YouTube. But they have universe pushing us through things. You know what I mean? And it's like with myself, it wasn't a, a directly at me, this tower moment, but it did affect two people in my life. And it's like when you have your loved ones go through such a drastic change and it was very aggressive and unnecessary um, on, it was this person's actions. You know what I mean? Like they should have taken a breath before making such a horrible decision. You know what I mean? But um, nevertheless, it is what it is. Like, that person needed what, where they are now. You know what I mean? Like, you know, I wish it could have been different. But, you know, do we really know people? Not really, you know? This reminds me of the Jason Possibilities card uh, in the Energy Oracle card as well. But there, it's like many opportunities. For some, it could be that. Some of you, it could be your love life and your work and your home that all changed... At, at this time some of us is one you know what I mean I feel like it's like what you could handle like in a situation over the weekend it was just like with myself my brain was fried I had a lot of personal stuff going down you know what I mean and it's just like go into training and I just had it you know what I mean over censored and everything and I exploded and then I had two panic attacks and a migraine it's just like ugh you know what I mean? That's why it's like, I knew I need to take time for myself. It's like, you know what? I'm giving and giving and giving. And it's like, now it's just like, now I'm imploding. It's like, okay, enough already. You know what I mean? So it's like, you got to sit there and learn that, you know, especially with that queen of cups energy that you're just as important as everyone else. You know what I mean? It's, you know, even though we don't want it, we want to say no. It's like, you know, okay. I'm helping you out. But it's just like, now it's becoming abusive. You know what I mean? Like, they literally asked me yesterday. I'm like, I need to take care of my home. Like, I'm the type of person... Like, my house isn't, you know, immaculately clean. Hell no. Like, it's like a... I call it the illusion of clean. You know what I mean? But it's like when things are looking a certain way, it's like it bugs me. You know what I mean? I want to get it done. I want to get it accomplished. I call myself lazy, but I know I'm not. It's just like I'm being pulled in every direction right now. You know what I mean? And it's just like... You know, we have to learn to nurture ourselves. We're nurturers, going back to the Queen of Cups of yesterday. And it's like, we got to learn how to nurture ourselves. You know, even though people's lives are shifting, it's like being there supportively or helping them out physically. You know what I mean? But it's like, it's mentally draining. You know, absorbing all these energies. Like, you know, and this person is still going on about it. I'm like, oh my gosh. Like, but I feel like, some things are shifting here. The magician. So I love the green hue of this because I feel like it's your heart chakra. Um, I feel maybe it's following your heart. You know, we did definitely touch that on with the Ten of Pentacles yesterday. Where it's like a decision that you make or things that you do affect others around you. So for some of you, you may be um, single and have like fur babies. Or it's like it affects your uh, immediate family. Where it's like I feel like a single male moving across the country to the West coast and the parents are just like, you know, heartbroken because it's like, it, I, you're not so easily accessible anymore where it's just like, you know, maybe you lived with your parents for this. I don't feel like you did, but it's just like, you know, they could just drive, you know, two blocks or whatever to come see you. Or if you needed anything when you're under the weather or anything, it's like for a parent, it's like you're in a new brand new city, a brand new, you know, province or state, depending where you're from. And, um, I feel like it's the States and I feel like it's just like, you know, it's like if anything happens, it's like, who's going to help take care of you? Who's going to, you know what I mean? So I feel like it's just as a parent, like you want to make sure that your kid is okay. You know what I mean? Like at all times. So I feel like once 
you're settled in a routine and make friends and maybe I feel like you're going to have a I feel like you're going to have a girlfriend almost immediately. I'm not sure if you're moving for a woman, but she's like blonde with long hair, you know? Um but it's like wavy, beachy kind of waves. So I feel like um they're saying the place that you work you're going to meet her. So it's just like in that kind of situation, it's just like um they'll feel better about that. You know, but initially it's just like, you know, I guess maybe you had a cold or something. They came and they took care of you, like bringing chicken noodle soup and all that stuff. Helping making sure that the house was clean while you were under the weather, stocking the fridge and everything like that. So it's like in that kind of case, it's not that they don't want you to have opportunities and grow. It's just like as a parent and I am a parent, it's just like, you know, I can't come and take care of you while you're under the weather. Like a parent's job never ends just because you know, your kids 30, 40, 50, you know, it's just like you sit there and always want the best for your children, even when they're married and have children of their, for themselves. It's just like, you know, I feel like you're very close to your parents. You know what I mean? So, you know, don't be harsh with them. I feel like anger about this from the male. And it's like, don't feel angry. It's just, they love you very much. And you know, you should count your blessings that you're so lucky. We have the page of pentacles. So I, or sorry, 10 of uh, potions because we're going on about love and everything 10 of potions this is unconditional love speaking of love and it's just like you know i feel like this is the energy we're moving towards you know they're talking about that sickle so tuesday you know at uh, my time four sixteen, it'll change from a pisces moon over to an aries moon this is where i'm like why does everyone keep saying it's an aries you know and then when i went on astro seek i clicked on it it still said Pisces and then I click on the actual date and it shows that the time changed. I'm like, Oh, it must be a change in the time where it switches over to Aries. So I feel like a lot of emotion and this is where the fire will come in. This is what they were telling us to embrace this year. Bravery, courage, strength, resilience. I was literally talking to a good friend of mine and, um, I was like, this card was sticking out in the pile. I'm like, I want to pull it. And it was like, you know, what I was going through, it's like with determination and dedication, you will be the victor wearing the wreath. Dedication and determination are my middle names. Determination is my middle name. It's like, you know, I will not take no for an answer. I will not just sit there and just like, you know, if I give up, it's like, okay, take a break. You know what I mean? And then it's like, go back. Let's see. Sometimes it's just like I give up too soon or I push too hard. You know, I've had that happen. Mold and Mouse House, for example. I should have just stopped looking. But it's, it was like, yeah, like they're saying, it was too good to be true. It was like, dang straight it was, you know, I should have known, you know, anyway. But a peace of mind was more important. But I love with the Ten of Potions, you know what I mean? I love the fact that it's just like we're going to be in the sweet sauce right with that sickle moon. So right after the new moon, in that new moon energy, it's just like this sweet time is coming. I definitely feel like a lot of us need this win. It's like for me, the past two weeks has been hell. You know what I mean? It's just like, I need a break. Like, you know what I mean? It's just like, I got to woos out and take care of me and my family. You know? It's just, I need to bring that back. You know what I mean? I don't mind helping out people, but now it's affecting my family. It's affecting me physically. It's like, I need to take a break. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I should not be having panic attacks. You know? That's not who I am. It's like, I don't even have time to meditate. You know what I mean? So it's just like, mm, you know? That's why I was just like, I'm exhausted. I, I was, my body was so heavy yesterday. I'm just like, ugh. You know, I was just like, get done what I need to get done. And it's just like, I did the dishes before I went to bed. It's like, you know what I mean? That's what I'm talking about. It's just like little things like that. It's like, I could save them for the morning, but I'm like, you know what? At least when I wake up, I don't have to look at that mess. You know what I mean? So that's just the way I function. I'm sure there's been days where it's just like, oh, we'll save it for another day. I was actually watching uh, The weekend, and it was like, save your tears for another day. It's like, yeah, save the dishes for another day. It's just like those days where you're just like, oh, I cannot even wrap my head around doing that right now. We have another positive card here with the page of presents. So I love that. I feel like I feel like a lot of people getting tax returns and something unexpected, you know, comes with it. You know, or something unexpected comes here. You know what I mean? Out of the blue. So I feel like, you know, th I feel like it's a really grounding energy. You know what I mean? But I feel like something out of the blue is coming here. It, it, that will put a smile on your face and you'll be really happy about it. So it's just, I love that. We have the fool. So it's just like that childlike energy. I love that. You know what I mean? And it's just like, that's what life is about when you're able to be in that childlike energy. Like, you know, adulting is hard enough. It's like, 
when you're at work is serious, like, you know, you know, life is so serious. And it's like those times that you get to be in your, that childlike energy is amazing. You know, you're carefree, not a care in the world where you're able to shut off your mind and just, you know, have fun. Just like leave all of that behind. You know what I mean? That's what life is about, you know? So it's like, we need more of those moments, please. You know? So these two cards on the side here, it's the five of swords. I'm going to see, I might have to pause this. Hold on. Yeah, I had to pause there. So like with the five of needles, this is the five of swords. This is where I like, look at that confrontation. This is like the ending of um, Nightmare Before Christmas. Hopefully I didn't spoil the movie for you. But I feel like it's like that verbal confrontation. You know what I mean? Like a standoff. But I don't, we don't want that. You know what I mean? Like, that's why I'm like, be careful of that emotional fiery side because it is a new moon it's like you gotta watch that you know what I mean it's just like where it's like our shadow side is there so it's like I feel like just shut up and listen right now even if you want to say something it's like bite your tongue you know bite your lips like shut it's like you know don't hold like pierce your lips shut I don't know but it's like no I feel like you know they're showing with the full moon here is the full moon like a confrontational time you know what I mean? High energy. I feel like it's right now. Hopefully it doesn't last all the way to the, the full moon. But it's just like, you know, I definitely when we had like Mercury in conflict with Pluto, I believe it was for Monday. It's for today, actually. It's just like, be quiet and listen. You know what I mean? And I feel like not, not enough people do that. You know what I mean? It's just... I literally was like, some people need to get hobbies. Like, you know what I mean? It's like, you have too much time to be stirring the pot. Like, you know, like what kind of, that's the, t I hate people like that. It's just like, oh, I stir up the drama and I stand back and watch it implode. It's like, you know what I mean? And they're just like, well, if they're stupid enough to, you know what I mean? And it's just like, what? Like people purposely try to stir stuff up. So with the world card, you've done it. You've come so far, been through so much and learned so many powerful lessons along the way. You're feeling satisfied, happy, and whole. Consider sharing your experiences with others. You have the ability to inspire people. So that's what knowledge is, 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 is wisdom shared and regurgitated. You know, that kind of sounds like, ugh, like vomiting, but it's like, you know, not trying to make it about ourself, but it's just like when someone goes through something, you know, I do say like when, especially when I'm doing personal readings, I'm like, I went through this situation similar to yours. Uh, like I always bring up when Shane passed away, it's just like to turn off my mind, I would watch Wendy Williams. You know, I know she's controversial, but she was funny and shady as hell. And I loved it. You know, um, it was able to turn off my mind for that hour and laugh. And it just, I, I, I was able to forget what my reality was for an hour. You know what I mean? It just gave my brain a break, you know, especially like what was going on lately. It's just like, you know, personal life was chaotic, you know, work life was chaotic and it's just like, okay, at least sleep, I get that break from it. But it was to the point where I was getting nightmares every night. And I'm like, come on. Like, you know, not my sleep too. You know what I mean? It's just like, oh my gosh. Like, you're getting attacked on all fronts. And that's where it leads to mental exhaustion and saying things and doing things that we would normally do. You know, so that's where it's just like, you know, I'm like, okay, things have to change. Like, thank God we're back to a normal week this week. You know what I mean? So it's just like, woo sao, get on our proper sleeping pattern again and, and everything like that. It's like readjusting, recalibrating, you know? For me, it's a bigger deal because it's just like, yeah, I get up during the day. Get things I need to get done. So that way I go to work and then I can just come home and go to sleep. So that way I still have that awake time, you know? But I also, you know what I mean? It's like splitting up my day, but it, it works for me. You know what I mean? I'm able to... Be highly productive and get a lot of things done. Take a nap and go to work and get be productive. At, you know what I mean? So it's just like that's what works for me. So it's like getting back into that sweet area again. So you're bubbling over with creativity and inspiration. Now is the time to do something meaningful with it. Put action behind your inspired energy to make real progress. Focus. Come up, op, um, come up with a plan and make your dreams come true. And I feel like right now is the time to focus. Like with us, we just went through training. We just got trained on a new system. And it's just like, okay, you know, we got trained on this. And it's just like, you know, focus. You know what I mean? During the downtime, it's like pull up, you know, certain things that will help us to 
be even better. What kind of thing, like with me, it's like, I'll sit there and get like everything ready. So that way I'm like, okay, you know, this, 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 like, you know, screenshots. I'm like, okay, so this one is cross trained with this, you know, cross sailing with this one. It's just, what can I do to make this easier? So I'm more successful is the way that I do it. It's like, instead of complaining about it, I'm like, okay, let's come up with a solution here. You know what I mean? So during training, I started, you know, but when people were doing things and we're waiting for them, it's like, I started doing like the phone numbers. I'm like, we get these calls the most, you know, so get this. So I have it ready at hand for guests. It's like, you call, boom, here you go. Instead of saying, can I put you on a brief hold? Well, it takes me 10 years to find this. You know what I mean? It's like, how can I make this an easier transition? So that's where it's just like, you know, using when situations come up, instead of sitting there and complaining about it, it's like, how can I make this transition easier? You know what I mean? Finding little tricks and stuff. Like with me, when we got trained on two other systems before this one, I sat there and they showed it, they did, did a screenshot of all the property. So I sat there and I was studying that between calls because it's just like, okay, I know what that is. You know what I mean? So it's just like, where can I sit there and for myself improve? And I shared it with everyone else. That's the type of person I am. It's like, I found this useful. You may too. You may not. You may want to delete it. It's like, oh, that's not useful to me. I learned this way. That's fine. But at least like someone where I could sit there and see it. Okay, this is this. This is this. It's easier for me to be like, okay, you know, this is how you say this. You know what I mean? So it's like whatever you could do to improve. You know what I mean? So that's the way I see it. It's like, how can I, how can I, make this challenging situation easier you know so with the ten of potions an important relationship friendship or family connection is finding its stride i definitely feel this with like you know more so with one child than the other the other one's like preteen like you know it's just like um i thank them like you know for being by my side it's like they're like can i do this can i i'm like no just like, I, I love that about him. It's just like, what can I do to help you? And I'm just like, that is so sweet. I'm like, you don't have to do anything. Honestly, I just, I need my sleep. You know, I need to re-energize. It's like the fact that I'm so heavy, you know what I mean? And it's hard for me to like, you know, get through the day. It's just like, okay, I need to sleep here. Cause I'm always like a ping pong, this, this, this multitasking. What can I do here? What can I do there? You know what I mean? So it's just like, like, even now, I'm like, oh, I could do this. And I'm like, no, 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 no. Let's take it easy. You know, we'll get it done. We'll get, try to get as much stuff does, uh, done as we can. And then, you know, get ready for the for the rest of the day. You're feeling supported, understood, and appreciated. Nurture this connection and remember to give as much as you can, you can, ta uh, you can take to maintain balance. I, uh, you know what I mean? Sometimes we have to show up a little bit more for others. You know what I mean? I Like, I understand what they're saying. So it's equal flow. Like, we don't have to go overboard. But at the same time, it's like sometimes we need to show up for people a little bit more. You know what I mean? And that's the way I was like, you know, if, when the shoe was on the other foot, I was just like, it would have been nice to have help or whatever. Or just someone there to support, you know? But, you know, nobody wants to be around someone that's sad. I'll just say that. You know, when you go through hard stuff, there are going to be people that will rock with you. That it will be your ride or die. Those are important people. So we go to the page of presence. You have been stuck with a great ideas with a, uh, when you least expect it. Woke up with a brilliant new scheme or plan for success. The page of presence represents someone who is feeling a sudden burst of creativity, a potential lucrative inspiration. It's time to bring your brilliant new vision to life. So I wanted to make this video, and unfortunately, because the last two weeks have been hell, I haven't been able to do this. So, you know, I'll probably do a couple, they're saying practice videos. I, I want to do it and then go full, like, you know what I mean? Like, I'll probably edit it because it's my first video doing this. Um, but it's just like starting this process of healing on a deeper level. You know, things that I can relate to. I'm not going to pretend that, you know, I know what I'm talking about when I don't. You know what I mean? Like, I'll never be that person. Uh, stay excited for this journey, and be, but be cautious. You never know what surprises may be waiting for you. I feel like, you know, when the, the student is ready, the teacher will come. And I definitely feel like that with Ella. 
Um, she's on TikTok and she's an, um, a Reiki he cleanser healer. Um, she, she's so inspiring. I really connect with her energy. There's been a, a, one other where she's more, um, different than Ella. Ella is more verbal. Whereas this girl does like clicks and sounds like stuff like that, but it still affects me. This, but not as potent as Ella, but it still affects me. So I'm like, okay. You know, when I see some of hers, I'll I'll stay for it. But Ella, it's like I it, you can actually feel like the change. You know what I mean? And it's just like I shared it with someone that's going through anxiety, and I'm like, you should watch this when you're feeling anxious. I'm like, especially after the the training finished, I'm like, I kept on doing energy pl plucks because I'm like, I need it. I need to get that energy out of me. Like, ugh, it was just very overwhelming. What the fool? Brand new beginning. Childlike energy. It's like getting excited for things. Like I'm getting excited for Easter, Passover. You know what I mean? So it's just like, I feel like you should um, get your preparations ready. I feel like if you, if this is only if you feel like it, if you, if this resonates with you, but like decorating and everything, I definitely like, that's for me, the more and more, and I'm not, this is not to put on anyone with, with Passover for me, like I'm getting more and more deeper into it. And it's just like, you know, now we're getting like runners for the table where we do our ceremony. You know, we have decorations. So it's like we're investing in it because this is what really speaks to me. You know what I mean? Like I have decorations for the kids, but it's like they're in that preteen age where they're just like, Meh. you know, they still enjoy like, you know, getting like, you know, they got comfort, new comforters and uh, they got some money to buy like a, a like a game or something like that. And I got them chocolates. Like, I'll always get them, like, chocolate, like a treat. You know, it's not because they're spoiled or anything like that. I just want them to know that, like, you know, I was thinking them. I love them. You know what I mean? I feel like for, like, you know, they don't follow the Passover, like, diet or anything like that. Like, you know, um, that's up to them. Like, they, they gravitate towards it or not, you know. But it's just like, you know, this will be the first year that I actually have matta. I try to make it myself uh, one year and I just... Nah, this didn't, didn't, didn't do well. Um, but this year it's just like, what can I do, you know, to delve even more into this? You know what I mean? So that's the, that deeper connection. Um, but I've always done the diet, you know, sometimes I made mistakes, but it's just like, you know, trying to do my very best with, you know, because we don't have a, a, a synagogue out here, not a synagogue. Oh my gosh. Yes. A synagogue. I'm getting all mixed up here, but I'm, I'm looking at my runner for Passover, but, um, it's exciting for me, you know, when you're able to sit there and bring that, like, you know, because when I first started this, she was just like, make sure you get Shabbat down. And I'm like, okay. So I educated myself on that. And then she said, hi holidays. I'm like, what, wait, what? <laughs> I'm like, there's more. <laughs> so it's just like educating on my, so, you know, from, I think it was 2018 was our first. I believe so, if I'm not mistaken, or 2019. I know we started, when I started learning about high holidays, it was kind of like later in the year. And it was just like, you know, getting that down. You know what I mean? So it's just like, you know, when you, you don't grow up with something, but it really resonates with you and makes you happy. That's where I am. It's like, that's my passion and fire. It's just like, you know, I'm excited for that. So I was supposed to put it up this weekend, but forgot we had training on Saturday and I'm like, Ugh. you know, I kept on making plans for Saturday. I'm like, wait, wait, hold on. No, I'm working. <laughs> this is like, ugh. So channel Jack Skeleton's childlike enthusiasm, uh, enthusiasm as you take your first brave steps forward, um, towards something new. So they're showing like, de like colored eggs and it looks like you're doing like an egg and spoon run. Like, that's what I'm seeing. You have grass in your area and it's like, oh, oh my gosh, good, God bless. I will be lucky if we see grass. <laughs> I think there's going to be a swamp by then. Uh, with limitless potential, there's no telling how far you'll go. But that's what I feel like. It's, ooh. Okay. Uh, dang. Is that like a sign? <laughs> my heat pump decided to make a loud noise. But it's just like, um, I feel like it's, uh, getting ready for something, you know what I mean? Like spring is like that. It's just like all the birds and stuff. I can hear them for a little bit already. Like the robins are awake, but it's just like, oh my goodness. Like it's really windy here today. It's ugh, and cold. It's not cold, cold, but it's just like that wind just like cuts right through you. But, um, 
I feel like if you feel that enthusiasm, to, like decorate, do whatever, you know, inspires you. Like, you know, like, I love that. I love sitting there and putting that up. I don't know. It just puts a smile on my face. It's just like, you know, during that time, it's just like, you know, it can be challenging because like, you know, with my kids, it's like, I don't like if they feel gravitated towards it, like fine, but I don't throw out all the, or donate or anything, uh, all the stuff that they enjoy eating, you know, like cookies and stuff like that. It's like, I have my, it's a discipline. It's like, that's what I, my journey, I'm not gonna, I don't expect my kids to be on that journey. You know what I mean? Like if they want to, then I can help guide them. But I would never be like, oh no, we have to get rid of all this because of me. Like, you know what I mean? It's just like, that's my choice, you know, but if any, if you're not familiar with Passover, it's like you're constrained from eating certain things. But it's just like, um, you know, it's a, a, I feel like very light at that time. You know what I mean? I feel very happy at that time. So, you know, you know, I'm grateful for being able to delve into the Hebrew faith, you know, what speaks to me, like, you know, so I just feel, you know, I was even watching mass last night cause I passed out for, I was so tired on Saturday. I ended up falling asleep during it. So it's like, I, I knew what part I, I, I fell asleep at. So I just went back and watched the rest of it. And it was just, you know what I mean? It's like, you never know what messages will speak to you. You know what I mean? And I feel like, especially Carly audience, cause my ear, my hearing has been so sensitive. It's like the answers to your problems are around you when you least expect it. And it's just like, if we listen, you know what I mean? And it's just like, you know, is it in your dreams? Like, you know what I mean? And I get a lot of channel messages during my dreams. That's why I was getting upset. I'm like, you know, one nightmare is one, but it's just like nightmare after nightmare. But I know it was because, you know, we are training at this time. So you're eating later. You know what I mean? I don't eat that late. You know what I mean? And then I'm going to bed because I got to get up and do my healing and readings and everything like that. So it was just, you know what I mean? When you're, when everything is just disruptive, 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 it's just like, ugh. you know what I mean? I should have known that I was in for a crash, but you know, that's why it's like, you got to look out for yourself. You got to sit there and nurture yourself. And like, that's what I'm saying. If you feel, I don't like when they say childlike, cause I don't feel like it's childlike getting excited for something in your life. I don't feel like it's childlike. I feel like this world is way too serious. It's like, you know what? Find the things that put a smile on your face daily and cherish those things. You are richer than you think. You know, when you look like we look at Sunny, it puts a big smile on our face. We're so lucky to have this baby boy in our life. You know, uh, the fact my child like freaking sitting there like, what do you need? You need me to do this? Do you need me to do that? Like, you know, you need to meditate, mom. And it's just like there's not enough hours in the day right now for me to meditate. You know, it's just like, you know, just those sweet little things in life. It's like those are the things you hang on to. Those are the things that you cherish. That like that's, you know, that is worth more than gold and silver. You know what I mean? Like you can never put a price tag on that. That is priceless to have someone support you like that at such a young age. And it's like, I never expected my child to ever utter those words. Maybe when they're older, maybe in their twenties, I'm like, Oh, maybe they get older. They'll appreciate what everything I do. You know what I mean? And for a 12 year old to be like, Hey, like I can see you're struggling. What do you need from me? What can I do for you? Like, let me do this and take it off your plate. I'm like, no, 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 no. You don't need to do that. Like you just continue doing your school and doing what you're doing. Like, that's cool. Like, you know, that to me, it's like, if I don't have to chase you down to make sure your work is done, like that to me is brilliant. One less thing I have to worry about. You know what I mean? That is one of the biggest headaches in my life is school, you know, chasing these kids down and making sure it's done, you know, but it's just like, you know, whatever you can do to make life sweeter, definitely do it. Don't think, I hate that word childlike, you know? I feel like it inspires you. It makes you happy. People may not get it, you know, just like tarot. This puts a smile on my face daily. You know what I mean? Some days it feels tedious because like there's a lot going on when life is chaotic, but you know, most of the time it just puts a smile on my face, especially when it really resonates, you know, and it's just like, Hmm, okay. You know, answers to what I'm going through. So it's just like, you know, just Take what resonates with you and just keep it at the back of your mind. It's just like, ah, that's what they were talking about. That's why I was being pushed forward. I feel like a lot of us are being pushed forward because I feel like procrastination and hesitation. Like we would never would have done it because, you know, so many things are going on. But it's like this is pushing you to where you go. We may not understand it. That's what I say. Like even when two weeks ago things were going like, oh, like what? Like what the hell is going on here? 
it, it, it it's really triggering because it takes us back to our childhood. And it's just like, um, you know, I sat there and I'm like, I don't understand why this is going on. I understand now, like it had to happen because of medical reasons, but it's like, it doesn't make it easier, you know, but at the same time, it's just like, I trust in Yahweh and Yeshua, you know, and you guys, whomever you resonate with universe, divine creator, Gaia, mother earth, yourself, like, you know, I'm not trying to push nothing on, on anyone, but I just, that put a smile on my face during that chaotic time. I'm like, I trust you wholeheartedly that you know what's best for us and I'm just going to go with this. Go with the flow. You know what I mean? So that's all you can do is just go with the flow. Like, that's why I didn't mind helping this person out because it's like, I know exactly how you feel. I went through that six years ago. So, you know, if I could be assistance and make this easier on you, I definitely will do everything I can. But there comes a point where it's just like, okay, I need to tap out here because I also have a life. You know what I mean? Like, I need to tap out here because I need to sleep. I need to tap out here because now my emotions are coming up in this. Like, I need to sit there and get me good so I can help you out again. That's where I feel like with the Queen of Cups came up, it's like you're a nurturer. You know what I mean? But you got to sit there and nurture yourself right now. Get yourself good so you can continue forward. You're no good if you're burnt out. You're no good if, you know what I mean? You, like, all of us have a purpose and some of us that do delve in deeper, it's like you're here to deliver messages and light. You're here to help people when they're like, I cannot carry on anymore. It's like, you need some sleep. You need, maybe you need actual medical attention. You need like an intervention where they could sit there and turn your brain off for a while. So you could just be like, okay, you know, it's just like, sometimes that's what we need. That's what I needed. My brain was going a mile a minute and I'm just like, okay, I need an intervention here because I'm going to freaking burn out here, you know? So you know, walk definitely helped. If that's, it's just like change that energy, ground yourself. You know, it was windy as heck, but it's like we got through it, you know, but it's just like, do be self-serving right now. Do what's best for you. So I hope you guys enjoyed these daily tarot cards for Wednesday, March 22nd, 2023. May the universe bless you good. We'll see you for the next daily tarot card.